hello everyone welcome to my next video which is related to the complete training on ANSYS this is Sanjay Agrawal and now this is my <coughs> series of videos which is actually related for the series of ANSYS and I'm going to show you this is my video which is regarding the model analysis model analysis is actually to find out the natural frequency and the mode shape of any body and I'm going to show you the natural model analysis on a cantilever beam I'm going to ANSYS and my workbench and this is a humble request for you if you haven't seen my previous video please watch my previous video it will help you to understand very easily because uh, this is my complete web series which is related to the complete training on ANSYS if you will see only my videos the complete videos you will see you will be able to understand the analysis what is exactly the analysis and how it performs it is going to open we will make a, a cantilever beam and on that particular cantilever beam we will find out the natural frequency and we can easily find out the natural frequency and the mode shape different kind of mode shape we can find out with the help of uh, ANSYS workbench in my previous vi video I showed the <coughs> structural analysis in which we can easily find out the <coughs> stress analysis and deformation one might say stress we can easily find out we have completed the workbench series as well we have completed our APDL series and this is the workbench at this workbench this is my model analysis which is using model analysis using mechanical APDL solver so this is the APDL solver which means ANSYS parametric design language I am opening it this is model an analysis and I am opening it <coughs> you can double click on it then you can it can easily open this is geometry I am going for geometry and I am going to make a a geometry for uh, which is look like a cantilever beam cantilever beam which has 100 millimeter length and cross section rectangular cross section rectangular cross section it's like rectangular cross section like 10 by 10 square square correct cross section this is my design modular and this design modular I'll make the design this is my hundred 10 meters and this is one and again as I'm extruding it <coughs> to one this is my cantilever view this is my cantilever view and this cantilever view I'm going to I'm going to cross it because I have made it this right tick that means key geometry have been made and I am going for model analysis <coughs> in the model section model analysis actually only for the natural frequency not for the force frequency we can only find out the natural frequency of any body if a body is in a vibrating motion and it is very important consideration without applying any load body vibrates and this vibration becomes frequency and this frequency is called natural frequency it is very important consideration for mechanical engineer to find out the natural frequency of any body because natural frequency helps <coughs> to break the material this is my model and this is right take on geometry 
flight recon coordinate system i'll have to make the mesh from the right click and the generate mesh this generate mesh will help to match the product and this product is matched and this matched product is there and model analysis i'm going for model analysis in this model analysis generate button we have only fixed part we don't have any option for making the load on that particular body i'm going to just fix support this is fixed support and i'm going to fix on this particular point and then okay okay then i'm going to solve it only the fix support is required this is this is going to be solved and <coughs> this solution will help you to find out the natural frequency and this solution is there in this solution we have made the tablet chat and this tablet chat has five six modes and this six mode has these type of frequencies you can select it and right click on it and make a create mode shape result <coughs> this result have been shown there and again you can solve it and this solution is done there and this is the solution total deformation you can find out total deformation total deformation is this is the total deformation you can find out <coughs> total deformation second you can find out and this you can easily find out the different kind of analysis different kind of deformation is there and this there is a different kind of analysis different kind of frequency and this is the natural frequency which is unit hertz 8.14158.1415 and this is the mode shape these are the mode shape of that object this is the by this way you can find out the deformation as well these are the deformation values these are the deformations values and this is the mode shape of that particular body and these are the natural frequency this is a very important consideration and important phenomena which help to find out the natural frequency of the object and this is a very easy method to find out the natural frequency if you like my video please subscribe and also comments likes if you want any kind of special requirement for your in answers then or you can also comment i'll make video for it as well so please subscribe my video thank you thank you so much thank you for listening